Hey everyone, welcome to, God, I was about to say taking Tarazona up then, but we are driving Depor forward here. Um, we're in mid-October, we've had a few matches, I've probably taken it on a bit further than I usually would, but in all honesty, I do have very high expectations of this division, um, and... Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm hoping to do well, so maybe take you for it a little bit quicker. I don't think I'm going to show you every match, but here you can see some of the scorers. So we started with that first game of the season, 5-1. And it's only relatively recently we've had a wobble. But the game after that, we of course, uh, we won that one. And uh, we got a few players in, two more players signed past uh, the deadline, past where we were last time. Uh, took us relatively late in this game, but Ferry, our target man, and Poacher at the same time. And then, uh, yeah, a set a set piece. In fact, I've shown you the, probably the two most boring goals um, uh, that we've seen so far. But Ferry um, has uh, come into the team um, instead of our, our five-goal supremo in the first match. And he's just uh, playing as I expected him to, really. So a lovely little dinked ball over the top. And look at that for a finish into the top bin. Absolutely wonderful stuff. And uh, we actually get another goal from a corner. So doing really, really well in that department. I will show you um, one of the goals here so he scores a header early on i think the last one's a little dink over the keeper from alessandro cortinivis or am i saying that right cortinovis i think is how i say it i believe this is the dink you can see we're pressing well and he just whoo, dinks it over the keeper there lovely stuff uh frino win getting his hat trick uh, he gets into position so well but unfortunately he doesn't always put things away um, I'll show you the first three goals here. They did get two late ones, but we managed to hold on. Mamadou Cisse, um, getting a goal and turning provider in this match, I believe. Um, but we kind of, uh, blasted them early on. Look at that for a, <laughs> a strange goal. So, uh, a header from, uh, almost the edge of the area there from Cisse. And you can see we've got some build-up in the wide area here. Cisse onto Ferry. And that's just a typical goal from us, isn't it, in terms of our tactic. And uh, we end up getting another one here outside of the foot goal to Ferry. Uh, sorry, outside of the football to Ferry. Um, wonderful stuff there. And uh, like I said, I'll leave that one there. Um, Salamanca, 3-1. Um, I'll show you um, Undur's goal. In fact, I'll show, you, I'll show you our two goals. I remember 58 is theirs, and I won't show you the penalty. So 45 and 77 we're interested in most. So this is our first goal. Look at that for a ball from Adley. He's done that quite often. And uh, here's our final goal. Wonderful spread of play there from Hamilton. And it's Cisse driving down the wing. And it's Endor who we're looking for here. He manages to... Uh, we managed to get the turnover here, I think. They're trying to counter-attack, but we are having none of it as they build up. But uh, our pressing's really good. And you can see Cisse switches it. Adley driving out wide, and I believe he whips it in to Endor for a nice little salmon-like header there. We beat Las Palmas 2-1. Um, we'll show Adley's goal. He's uh, really coming to his own on the left wing. He drifts inside, and uh, yeah, just a really, really good player uh, for this level, that's for sure. I think he gets a header here, so it's a nice whip cross. And Adley gets the header, and uh, they do get one goal back, um, but we, we managed to see out the game. But that wasn't the case in the last one. We go down to a very, very late goal here, and I will show you the goals here, because look at that, 2.5 to 0.3 in terms of the XG. Really, really uh, unfortunate stuff there. But again, our, our kind of uh, winger drives to the byline, a nice composed finish from Ferry. And at this point, I just thought, well, there's no one, no one's going to catch us. We're going to go this season unbeaten. Or maybe we're even winning every game. But look at that for a through ball. And a good finish from uh, our Italian Mazzala. 
But they do end up getting a goal back. I think it's through a header, actually. You can see uh, our defenders not picking up particularly well. And then um, we do manage to concede. I think I've clicked on the right thing there. We want to take it on just a fraction, don't we? But this is in the 91st minute. Maybe I should have been less naive and kind of gone to a defensive tactic. But great through ball. And it's top bins. And we are to all. We then lose the next game. Uh, it's a pretty close fought game, but you can see from the ratings of our forward players, they just didn't play well at all. There was one chance, I remember where, it was squared across the box to Ferry, and he just he just hit it right at the keeper. But I must say, it's a great goal. Look at that. Crossfield ball into the finish. And the game I've just played here, I'll show you the goals from. We end up going 3-0. Really, really great performance. Their striker missing quite a, quite a few chances apparently, but uh, in the rain we come up trumps. This is a typical goal from us. Ferry, bottom corner with his header, and you can see Hamilton helping to build up the play here, and uh, Adley with a through ball like we've seen before. And look at that for a composed finish, top corner, and it's. Uh, Again, I've got, to, I've got to slow his name down. Cortinovis, uh, keeper not covering himself in glory there at all. But if I show you the table, we are in second place with a game in hand. And uh, we're top of the XG table. We're conceding more than we should. And we haven't been particularly good in front of the goal recently. But we hope to change that today against Mirandes. We'll check what kind of... Uh, Formation they play, they're a direct Gagan press, so I'm going to keep the line high and and hope we can kind of uh, maybe have a few of the through balls offside. But it's going to be important to have some more pace at the back. Uh, unfortunately, uh, Moritz Jens, who's our kind of like main defender, uh, to be honest, he's been injured for a few weeks, so that's unfortunate. So we'll have uh, Mendes in there, I think. Um, and actually... I am going to put in Alcedo, who's a little bit more pacey in the left back area. And uh, Guerrero has done all right. So this is kind of our, our starting 11, really. And we will go with that, I'm pretty sure. We do have some really sort of high potential young defenders, but they haven't covered themselves in glory, particularly recently. We want to pick up where we did last time and we'll get straight into it. So, Mirandes, a club we considered joining. We put in a... Uh, I don't think we actually formally put in a job application this summer, but we've been to interviews previously with them in the same summer where we didn't um, take the Crystal Palace job. But our left back clears it away. We're a bit slow to get out. And they play it in, and it's a save from our keeper, Suarez. Uh, and that highlight comes to nothing. Looks like they have the momentum early on, but we've come swinging back. Uh, they've had the two early shots, however. It looks like we're going to pick up here for a little bit of a counter-attack. We'd like this to be played inside with a bit of composure. There we go, and it's Hamilton on the ball now. Our first proper test in this league, I would say. I mean, even though we've lost a game, this is uh, a, a good team. Lovely ball from Alonso to Adley. He drives inside, back to Alonso, spread the play. It's great composed stuff. I'm actually going to tell Alonso just to chill out a little bit. I'm a bit worried he likes to fly into tackles, but uh, we'll ease off tackles until half time. Then I think we might sub him in a game of this importance. But it's really even match so far. Lovely throw into Ferry, but there's no one really to nod it onto. And can we pick up this ball? We do. Hamilton with a great touch down to Mendes. And it's to our winger, Cisse. He drives down the byline into Cordinovis. Adley picks it up. Can he whip it in first time? Oh, and it's to our deep line playmaker. I'll show you his stats at the bottom here. You can see he's on loan. A good little playmaker there. But for some reason, we've lost the crowd noise here. I don't know if that's affecting you guys as well. But 
Hamilton picks up the ball. We've got it back and Francis gets there and he wins the second challenge as well. We're spreading the play. Our left back's free, but it's into Ferry. He shoots and it really comes to nothing. Everyone kind of, you know, playing okay, but nothing fantastic here. We pick the ball up again and it's wide with Adley. It's a great ball to Ferry. How many times has that worked? It's a good strike. Gets his shot away. And the keeper actually takes it out for a corner. Apologies if my voice is a bit husky. I've been suffering from a cold this week. Oh, the goalkeeper spills it. Cortinovis is still there. And that's got to be a penalty, hasn't it? Oh, my goodness. Are they saying he dived or what? No idea. Bizarre. Right. I'll say we can still win this. We'll bring up Alonso, who's on the yellow card, on for Serrano. I'll show you him. He's the player we uh, ended up signing. We'll take the uh, ease off tackles. He flies into tackles anyway. Um, but our, our team is not playing badly. We just want to protect against the yellow card there. So I'll say to him, um, faith in you to go out and make the difference. And we'll go with the second half. Bit disappointed in our showing so far but both these teams did get relegated and are both looking to get promoted apparently these are our main rivals for promotion as our right back drives inside but Cisse is keeping the width there I think this is one of those highlights uh, in the match engine that's going to come to nothing there we go just as I predicted but we're doing much better in the momentum and the XG now so that's good we're finally ahead of them this uh, could be one of those frustrating games, couldn't it? Although, Full has on a free kick. It's whipped in. And with that animation, I thought it hit the post. But I think the keeper just kind of grasped it. But they get a, a throw in now. And can we get the turnover? We do with our left back, Juan Maria. It's Adley. Come on, whip it in, son. Cisse takes it in his stride. And it's a great block. We've got some pace to bring off the bench, but I don't know whether I want to change from this formation particularly, seeing as we are the away team. We'll save it if they end up getting a goal. It's a ball over the top, but it doesn't come to anything, and I hope we can just build that from the back here. And it's to Hamilton, our ball-playing defender, back to Mendes, and it's worked really nicely out wide. Patient play here. From Depo, Cortinovis dropping deep and oh, Cisse ends up giving it away, which is frustrating. Can we counter press? We can. Hamilton heads it into midfield, but they win the turnover. Don't expect us to win it for the second time, but we do. Ferry's now driving to the byline. And it gets tackled again. God, it's like a basketball match, isn't it? But we're in the ball for the third time. Cortinovis. Oh, what a strike in off the bar. Oh, that reminded me of a Ronaldinho goal from back in the day. Wonderful stuff from Cortinovis. Ah, oh, Italian. I, I wish the match engine replicated his hair better because it's quite the hairstyle. But look at that from a strike. Oh, in off the bar. Bouncing into the roof of the net. And the fans, the away fans go crazy. Now let's hope we can keep things a little bit more solid than we have previously. Now they get a free header and Suarez manages to get his hands on it. It's whipped in again. It's another header. Suarez gets there. I'll take our pace down a fraction. Because this is an important win if we can get it. Maybe I want to freshen things up a little bit. No, I'll, I'll keep it as it is. We're doing all right, aren't we? Um, I'll bring people on if we lose some stamina. They get a free kick, though. Oh, and it's a wonderful goal. I knew we'd go down to something like that. What can we do? Two wonder goals, really, in this game. I mean, our wall's not even getting to that. Our keeper's not getting to that. It's just unbelievable stuff. I think we're going to take off Ferry. He hasn't really done much. And we'll bring on Undor. 
and yeah, I'll, I'll keep it. Oh, do you know what? I'll bring off our fullback. Uh, the fullback who's coming on has uh, fantastic crossing. So faith in you to make the difference. We'll just hope for a corner or a set play now, perhaps. But pretty low XG from from both teams. Looks like our team is kind of running out of energy, really. Hopefully, hopefully we can get this Mendes with the header. Cisse is good in the air, but he loses out. And they've got some great interplay. That's a wonderful ball. And Suarez saves us with the one-on-one -on -one there. And uh, we're going into the last minute now. But slightly disappointed, uh, considering we scored a wonder goal. Well, I suppose so did they. And we're away against our title rivals. Uh, not the worst result in the world, but we did shave the XG. So that's disappointing. We have more players with a higher rating. Um, disappointed seeing as we had lots of chances. And yeah, Ferry not coming up trumps. Uh, but at least... Um, Sporting lost earlier in the game week and we're two points behind them and yeah thanks for tuning in guys hopefully next time I'll I'll do a video where we're top of the table all right see you guys